here is a question on square and square root the question is the product of two number is 1296 if one number is 16 times the other find the number so here they have given that when you multiply two numbers the product is 1296 and they have given the relationship between the first number and second number at first number is 16 times the other number so we have to use this relation and find the numbers so since we don't know the numbers here we're going to assume that numbers are like a variable a and b you can take any variable you can take x y p q so here i'm taking the numbers to be a and b now here they have given a relationship that the first number is 16 times the other number so we're going to rewrite like we're going to write the one number in terms of the other number so one number is 16 times the other number means a will be equal to 16 times the other number which is b you can also take b is equal to 16a it doesn't want to change the uh, value of the number like the answer so you can take a is equal to 16b or b is equal to 16a both are correct way now when you multiply these two numbers your answer is 1 2 9 6 so first number is a and the second number is b but in place of b we're going to use this relationship that it is 16 times the other number so we're going to rewrite this one so from the question we're going to use this relationship from the question we know that a times b is equal to or let me rewrite this so in place of a i go write down 16 b so when you multiply these two numbers we are getting 1 2 9 6 but we know that first number is 16 times the other number so in place of a i'm going to put 16 b times the b is equal to 1 2 9 6 now b into b is b square so we'll get 16 b square is equal to 1296 now I want the b value so I'm going to isolate 16 by transposing this to the other side so it's like in under multiplication when it goes to other side it will become like it goes to division so b square is equal to 1296 divided by 16 you can directly divide this number by 16 or you can cancel this one I'm going to cancel here I'm going to cancel this in two tables so 2 8 is 16 then we have uh, 2 6 are 12 and then we have a 9 it doesn't go so 2 4 is a 8 1 is a remainder so that makes the number 16 so 2 9s are uh, sorry 2 a is a 16 let me rewrite this it's a 2 8s are 16 now again we're going to cancel this 8 and 6 48 and you can cancel this in any table so i'm going to cancel this in 4 so 4 2s are 8 now uh, we have a 6 so 4 1s are 4 2 is a remainder we got 24 4 6 are 24 we have 8 so 4 2s are 8 so we got 162 again cancel this in two table 2 1s are and then 2 8s are 16 and 2 1s are 2 so we got here 81 so b square is equal to 81 but we want here b value we don't want b square value we want b right so i have going to remove the square to remove the square you have to take a square root on both the sides so square root on both the sides when you do it what happens here is on your left side the square and square root will get cancelled because the square root is nothing but the power half so 2 and 2 will get cancelled and you will get b value so let me explain like the square root is nothing but the power will be half so 2 and 2 will get cancelled here and we'll get b so b is equal to 9 square root of 81 is 9 so we get b value is equal to 9 now if the b value is equal to 9 we can able to find the a value we know that a is 16 times b right using that we're going to find out the b va a value so a is equal to 16 multiplied by 9 so from here a is equal to we got the a value which is equal to 144 so that's it we have got a and b value a is 144 and b is equal to 9 when you multiply these two numbers you'll get 1296 so that's it i hope this question is clear in case you have further question or doubt you can drop a comment thank you so much for watching